Saturday, September 7, 2013. This is Mercedes Diesel Guy, and this is my 1979 Mercedes 240 diesel parts car. Continuing with dismantling the car, and I wanted to show you how to take the rear seat out. This is actually really easy. Uh, the bottom part comes out without any tools. Basically, there is a... Let me show you. It's here, on the left and right sides. You push these in. It'll release the spring clip, which will... Uh, uh, pop the front of the seat up a little bit, and then you just lift the front of the, the uh, bottom of the seat out. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Like I said, you just push these straight in. And once you have the bottom of the seat out, you can remove the uh, top portion of the back seat. And in order to do that, you have to release a couple of bolts. There's one here on uh, each side at the bottom, and then there's one. There's one in the middle, kind of right there. Uh, underneath the uh, armrest, which I think is actually missing in this car. So I'm going to remove these three bolts and then I'll show you how to get the seat out. And then once you have those three bolts out, you actually have to lift the seat up because it, uh, it kind of hooks onto the back here of the, uh, of the car. So lift it up to release it, uh, to release it from the tabs here on the uh, metal part of the rear parcel shelf. And then you can uh, lift the seat around the seat belts and get it out of the car. So. so here it is outside of the car and as you can see aside from needing further cleaning the vinyl is actually in great shape. The uh, fabric at the bottom definitely got chewed up by whatever animals were in the car and the horsehair padding I've never seen horsehair padding more dry and brittle than this. This is shot so what I'm actually going to end up doing for this is just tearing this out and then uh, feeding foam here, uh, sheets of foam through the springs uh, to uh, rebuild the seat. So this is Mercedes Diesel Guy and thanks for watching.